You're most welcome. Gathering as we do on this 18th of March. We're back into the season of Lent with a short reprieve on St. Patrick's Day. Just thinking about St. Patrick and the varying hardships that he endured and his tremendous love of God and how he asked God to enrapture him with that beautiful hymn that is ascribed to him. Christ be beside me, Christ be before me, Christ be behind me. Christ all around me. And when we just think of St. Patrick and the austerity that was part and parcel of his life. He didn't have the comforts that we have. But the one beautiful aspect of his life that Christ was central to his life. And Christ is central to your life and my life as well. And just to pause a moment or two and to, like St. Patrick, invite the Lord in a deeper way into your life. As we journey on from St. Patrick's Day and journey towards Palm Sunday where we like the Israelites at the time of our Lord Hosanna in the highest to you Lord to praise and to thank the Lord And to ask him to bless you and bless your loved ones near and far away and just to open your heart to the power and presence of his most holy spirit leading you and leading me towards the great and wonderful celebration of the Paschal Mystery in less than two weeks time when we will celebrate the birth of the Eucharist when we will journey with Jesus to the Garden of Gethsemane and there realising the tr tremendous terror that he would go through the forgiveness and the love and the hardship which he celebrated and the cruel torture by being nailed to the cross Lord I ask you to bless me and to bless, bless my loved ones as I journey. With great confidence, with my hand in your hand, Lord, and your hand in my hand, grasp me and hold me. As I pray with you to the Father, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. 
thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Mary, our mother and mother of the Gael, of the Irish, we pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and that the hour of our death, amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen.